Hello guys, on today's video we'll be talking about the American Landry's Peak, its facts and all you need to know about this peak breed. The American Landry's is a large breed of domestic peak which is descended from the Danish Landry's. They are white in color, have long bodies, fine hair, fine hair coats, long snouts and heavy droopy ears. The American Landry's is bred majorly for pork. It is derived from the Danish Landry's. In the early 1930s, the United States government purchased 24 Danish land races, which was to be used for swine research studies. In 1950, the American Land Race Association was established. The American Land Race was formed from crossing the Danish Land Race with Norwegian and Swedish Land Race breeds and with the Poland China breed. The American Land Race is long, lean, white in color, and have up to 16 or 17 ribs. The head is long, the sides are well fleshed. The sows of this pig breed have good maternal skills and therefore make good mothers. And they also and they also produce a lot of milk for their piglets. The land race are the fifth most recorded breed of pigs in the United States. Over the years, just from the 24 Danish land race pigs gotten from Denmark, millions of American land race pigs have been produced, and the land race is also, also noted for its ability to to crossbreed with other pig breeds and it is also used mostly as a maternal sire in commercial farms. The American land race is known for their body length, carcass weight in the ham and loin and good dressing percentage. For the American land race to be registered as a pure breed, as a pure breed in the United States, the hair color must be white. Dark skin spots are considered undesirable. Black spotted pigs cannot be registered as pure breeds. Oh. Mm -hmm.